y'all welcome back to the channel it's nisha here with another vlog um so yeah it's tuesday um today is my last day off before i go back to work for two days and then i'm off for an extended weekend to celebrate easter with me and my family uh, when i say my family i mean my family as well as my sister family they're going to be coming over on sunday i'm going to be cooking a pretty big meal um so yeah i'm pretty excited about that uh I cook all the time. Well, I used to cook all the time before this whole transition between two homes and then whatever. But either way, um, I'm excited that everyone's coming over. Um, so of course, that doesn't mean that I will not be still in the shop, AKA my garage, because I, <laughs> I don't, I mean, I'm going to Lowe's right now. Um, and I'm also gonna be meeting with my very first client um that has asked me to make something for them um so i'm not i'm kind of nervous because it's one thing to make things for yourself and you know what i'm saying and if it's a fail it's a fail you know what i'm saying like it it is what it is you know um you just you just scrape off you know you just dust off your knees and you just get back up and try again and that's kind of how like i feel about my home projects because there is the entryway table that it looks good, but it's not great. And it was my first like real DIY, I, I want to say. Was it? I think it was. So eventually I want to make some changes to it. Um, like I said, it looks great in my entryway and I get compliments on it all the time, but I think I want to make some changes, but that's down the line because I have six million other things that are that is in this mind of mine and so many other collabs that i need to put first because you make these agreements with people to do stuff and you have to get it done so um those are things so that's just something that's on the, the back burner um because the one that i have works it's just that it's not great especially since now i know that my potential is better if that makes sense so, um, yeah, I'm going to go to Lowe's and then I'm going, cause I need to price out some materials. Also, um, my next big project, other than the project that I'm going to be doing for the new client is going to be, um, Kai's room. As you know, he's here all the time, him and his mom, <laughs> which I love my girls. Um, so it does, it doesn't bother me as much. And plus Ariel helps me out with my channel as well as other things, my eyelashes. Um, but yeah, so that's my next big project. I want to build his bed. Yeah. So the thing with that is, um, everything has just been so back ordered. I was able to order his mattress and his box spring, which came pretty quickly. Um, but everything is just so back ordered and with him being such a little guy and I want him to have a queen, not a queen, a full size bed. So when she's over, she can sleep in the bed with him. Um, or if, you know, it's just something he can grow into. I want it to be more low profile because he's, he's little, he's only three. And I want him to be able to like, even though he can climb up into my bed, which is tall, I don't want him to like have to struggle as much. So I want to build him more of a low profile bed. Um, so that's what I'm gonna be doing today is pricing out materials. And then I wanna probably hit up a couple thrift stores to see if I can find him a small little dresser. Um, he doesn't need a huge one because he doesn't live here. Um, but when he comes over, he has clothes that you know I buy and keep here. So when he comes over, he doesn't really need to bring anything. So. That's what we'll be doing today. And then um, I need to clean. I need to clean. Um, that's another thing. When, when you're vlogging back to back and literally in this, this is vlog number three. <laughs> and I've only been off for a day and a half. So this is vlog number three. Your house takes a beating and my house is taking a beating. Um, yeah, so. I need to clean and get ready for the weekend. So I'm gonna just show you what my flex room is looking like right now. Don't judge me. 
Okay, so this is the kitchen area. That's the bags from the stuff that I bought yesterday that needed to go in the garbage. Those containers still sitting up there. My floor has pollen tracked all over from the garage to the back door from when I was moving stuff to do the patio. But let me turn the light on. <laughs> Look at this. This is my entryway. This is my entryway. Look at that desk. These are all things that I need to <laughs> vlog, do some type of a collab, I mean, do some type of a vlog on. Um, yeah. And then... <laughs> when I tell you this room is a hot mess so I need to get this together because like I said I'm having people over even though they're family I still like to you know have a decent um a decent present presentation when people come over and because I've already told multiple of my uh, neighbors they're always welcome to come over and have a drink at my Bartesian they can't see this they can't see this. Well, they probably see it because they some of them follow me now. But either way, I'm going to show y'all my outfit of the day and we're going to hit these streets. All right. Okay. Quick outfit of the day is just um, a white cami with a two-piece uh, linen set that I got from Old Navy. Some white Adidas and a white Michael Kors purse. Nice and simple. This is also a problem area in my garage. It looks a hot mess, I know. Um, this is where I keep all of my building stuff, but it's not organized and it looks a hot effing mess right now. So I, I need to organize and get some um, better systems going over here because I keep buying repeated stuff because I can't find what I'm looking for. So. Hence the reason I got three pair of glasses. Um, I've bought two paint can openers and I don't know where either one is. I keep using the screwdriver because I don't know where it's at, where they're at. So I need to work on this after Easter. This will be one of my projects is to figure out shelving and an organization system, some labels, all of this for this area. Last but not least, Last but not least, before I get in this car, is this freaking stove. I know y'all keep seeing it. I know y'all are like, why does she have a stove in her garage? I well, like y'all need to see me for this one. So, for my ones that's been here for a while and has watched most of my vlogs, you know that we had a Lona stove for about three months. Two months? Almost three? This is the Lona stove. When our new stove came, the project manager told the people to put the Lona stove in our garage and he would pick it up in a day or so. A day or so has been over a month. I've asked him several times about picking it up. He's told me he'll pick it up. Here it is, still in my garage. My subdivision is almost complete. So guess what they'll be doing? Moving on. This probably will still be here. I'm not asking again. This is a brand new stove. It's been used maybe 10 times. Guess where it'll be? Offer up, marketplace, <laughs> uh, neighborhood app, whatever. I got wood to buy. So either he picks it up or somebody else will be enjoying this nice gas stove that's only been used about five times. <laughs> Out of here. I'll talk to y'all in a bit. Y'all, please tell me why I was in Lowe's for four hours. <laughs> four hours. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I was in there so long that I decided to become a pro member and get a credit card because that's how much I'm in there. It made more sense for me to just sign up, get the credit card, 
just so I can get help bringing all this lumber home set up um, so I don't have to keep putting it in my truck. I did that. Um, I did secure my first client. My first client works at Lowe's, so he always sees my projects um, because I'm always asking for like little help here and there or I'm just in there and most people think I'm kind of out of place when I'm in there. And then when I start showing like <laughs> what I do, they get intrigued. And when I showed um, this time um, my patio set, other people start asking me for my business card <laughs> and I don't have no business cards. So yeah but anyway that's a that's another story i will be building i didn't never i didn't never i didn't never that don't even make sense i never told y'all what the request was from my client um so he asked me to build a sofa table um which is because he's a bachelor so he likes to be able to have a, he wants a sofa table to sit up behind his sectional and he has two stools that he wants to put up to them so that he can kind of sit and eat and watch TV. Because the if he has it the other way, then his back is to the TV. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to be building that probably either this weekend or Monday or Tuesday while I'm off. But anyway, pretty excited. Um, I also got the wood for Kai's bed. Um, all of that wood, his wood plus my wood will be delivered on Friday because I'm a pro member now. <laughs> and um, yeah, so they're going to deliver it for me on Friday. So I'm pretty excited. I don't have to like haul it myself. So then I left there and I stopped by um, Michael's because I had saw someone else's vlog and they were doing like a shot with me and they were at Michael's. I was like, well, let me stop in there and see what they got. And I ended up getting this sign for the laundry room because, you know, that's one of my projects that I'm planning to be doing. And it was 50% off, so it was originally $15, bucks, so I paid $7.50. And then I think they also gave me another 10% for military because she said it was in the system. So, um, And then I got this for the office to go on the bookshelves that I'm gonna build. Um, this black and white camera. I thought this was so cute. It's just very um, fitting for all that's going on in my life right now. Um, and it was 25 bucks, so 12.50. So not bad. And I think I paid 18, I paid 18 dollars even. So, 15, 40. So yeah, this was, a total of 40 bucks and I pay $18 for the both of them. So not too bad. And then I went to Big Lots because it was a couple of like lights down and on my way home. And I just got my stinker, um, a new cup, another cup. It had dinosaurs on it. It's like eight bucks. And then I got him um, a waterproof mattress protector because, you know, I'm building his bed. And um, sometimes, like, he gets sick. Well, like, he was just sick last time, and he was and he throws up because he's choking. So I figured I would get him a mattress protector um, for those reasons because he doesn't wet the bed, but, you know, he'll throw up here and there. So that's, oh, no, no, no. And then I went to Walmart because, let me tell y'all, these Premier Protein Shakes, delicious, delicious. So I got some more of those and some whipping cream because I am going to be baking um, a whipping cream pound cake or two for Easter because that's what my family likes and that's what I one of my cakes that I bake. So for now, I am going to clean my house, clean my house because it's a mess. So I guess I should do that. All right, I'll be back. Hey, so I received <laughs> this um, vacuum cleaner from Lavoie. Hey guys, so um, I received this cordless 
um, stick back from Lavoie and it's a Vortex IQ 40. It's one of their newer products. So since my house is a mess and that's what I'm gonna be doing today, I figured what better video and what better day to open this product and use it for the first time. So um, the vacuum is supposed to be able to adjust to how much it suctions based off of the amount of debris that's in that area. So it's supposed to be able to like adjust to like, if there's not a whole lot of debris to a lot of debris. So, and then you're supposed to be able to also watch the, wash the filter as well. So let's see what I need to put together and how long it takes to charge. And then I can go and do other stuff AKA get rid of all of this stuff that's in this living room and prepare to vacuum it and the stairs and the rest of my house. This is a mess. All right, so let me attempt to put it together and then I'll be back and show you what it looks like. This was probably the most simple vacuum ever to put together. It took me about three minutes. Um, I don't know if I never told you this or ever, never, ever, never, ever. Either way, I don't know if I told you this, but um, maybe I ain't good with instructions. I don't know what it is, but some somehow I just ain't. But this had a picture and it just said put A into B into B to C to C. And I was like, this. And it did not have any screws. Baby, <laughs> this right here is already a win. Three minutes. Because I've already wasted enough time today at Lowe's. And then it has this charging station. So, you see that? You slide it on there. And then it comes with a couple of screws for you to mount it to the wall. I don't know which wall I'm going to mount it to yet. But it's gonna be mounted. I just gotta figure out where I'm gonna put it. Oh no. Oh no. I could put it in the laundry room. For now, it's gonna lay down. It's gonna lay down now while I think about it. It's gonna lay down and charge because um, I'm gonna do some other stuff. <laughs> making 60 million trips like individually I just put everything on the stairs that need to go upstairs and then I just make multiple trips with that so I guess I probably should do that and then hopefully by then the new vacuum is charged because downstairs looks so much better so yeah let me get to that taking these stuff upstairs and then seeing if my vacuum is ready to be used.
Hey, babe. Wanna know my thoughts on this vacuum? This thing is the truth. <laughs> I am impressed. Not every product that people send me or want to send me or have sent me has made my channel. I've had some stuff and I've been like, mm -mm. baby, I can't sell this to the people. I can't sell this to the people. I can't convince people to buy this because I wouldn't even pay for it. Yeah, had people. And I'm like, mm -mm. no, but this right here, if you in the market for a vacuum, this is it, this is it. It's so freaking lightweight. It's super, super lightweight. It has an extension whether or not you want to get those cobwebs up there or if you want to get on the stairs. If you don't want to bend over, like, I mean, it is, this is it. And the fact that the suction is low and in the moment that you need something heavy duty to pick up something bigger, you hear it. You, I don't know, I, I tried to make sure that y'all can hear it. I'm gonna point it out throughout this video. But when I tell you I'm impressed, I'm gonna link it down below. All right, y'all, house is clean. I feel pretty good. I need to probably do some laundry, but that's gonna happen tonight while I'm trying to stay woke for work. So let me show y'all what the flex room, not, it's not the flex room. It's not, it's the office. Let me show y'all what the office look like now. The reason I said the flex room, because it was catching everything, honey. It was catching everything, but it don't catch stuff now. So let me show you what it looks like. Okay, so all this is cleaned. I just need to wait for those to dry so I can put them where they go. Floors are clean. Stairs are clean. And most importantly, This area looks amazing. I am impressed because it didn't even take me a long time. I don't even know why I've been stalling. But, yep. Other than another <laughs> box I need to do something with. And then, of course, this is Dante's. He's going to be using my hands ashy. Um, he's going to be using that on Friday when he comes. So, I'll just leave that there. But, yeah. Yeah. I'll be working on this room pretty soon because I plan to do some, um, in this room, I plan to build two bookshelves to go on either side. I have some artwork that I'm going to put up there. Um, and then I have some more decor stuff that's going to go in here. I need to get a cabinet, like a file cabinet to put, you know, important stuff in. Um, and then some curtains. So, yeah, this room will be one of my next, well, soon to be projects because I feel I'm more productive when I'm sitting at a desk. I don't know if that's just me. It could be. And maybe it's in my head. I could be lying, but I feel that way. So um, with all the things that I have kind of coming up, I feel like I need to do that. But for now, I am going to go check the mailbox and I'm going to sit outside on my new porch not the patio the porch and just kind of be nosy i'll be back hey guys so as i was um getting ready for work today i realized that i did not close out this vlog um i probably should because on my next day off which is friday i plan to get straight into some diys so um yeah i guess i will close this vlog so i can Get ready for my next one. I hope you all have after Easter. Bye.